But California, of course, is, is going big on clean energy. For a period of time, 15 minutes to six hours each day for the last month or so, the state's energy grid has been fueled 100% or more by clean renewable energy. And then when the sun goes down, they take that solar and put it into the grid while the demand is still high because the power demand is high in the late afternoon and early evenings when people come home from work and they turn on their ovens and lights and computers. The idea of getting all of our energy from clean renewable energy felt like some fringe, far-fetched, futuristic notion. And today, it is our lived experience. They broke 25% on Sunday night. This is the fifth largest economy in the world. The number one power source came from lithium-ion batteries. This is what the future is going to look like. Why? Because nothing is the same now. California has the technical potential to meet all of its electricity needs 38 times over from solar alone. Batteries are going down in price. We, we, we saw last week that there's gonna be a glut of them, a glut of manufacturing, so the prices are gonna just tank. And if, if anyone's saying, hey, what about the batteries and the minerals? We had stories before and we'll have them again. We'll remind you that the minerals and batteries today will be in use 130 years from now, one study says. There is a lot of mining associated with batteries because you do need these minerals, but it's it's a drop in the bucket compared to the mining we do every single day to dig up oil and then use it once by burning it. So this is uh, absolutely stuff that can be recycled. So the mining eventually will tail off. We won't need as much as it as we need now, but uh, this is a great future. For more, subscribe to the Clean Energy Show podcast.